Hey guys, welcome to our fourth generation farm in the hills of eastern Tennessee. Today we're going to show you how we built air loading chute using repurposed lumber and cedar trees that we've harvested from our property. We're building our loading chute onto the side of our big garden fence, so we have to remove some of the steel posts and replace them with the wooden cedar post. We're using our John Deere 2240 tractor with an auger to dig two foot deep holes for air cedar posts. Jesse and Jade wanted to help, so we will. When Jeremy harvested these poles, he made sure that the cedar trees would make at least an 8 foot pole that was around 8 inches wide.
the cows thought I had feed. Here the ground was so hard that I had to use a tamping bar for leverage to force the auger into the ground. The auger doesn't always make perfect holes. So sometimes I have to go back and fix them to where the post to fit in it right. This is the downfall to harvesting your own poles because they ain't always the same size.
Give me a thumbs up. Here we got both sides down with the set of hand gates. finally done with our loading chute corral whatever you want to call it we're going to use it to pin our cows up and we get ready to sell or uh, medicate them or anything like that worm them foot cattle panels on top of two by sixes and cedar post it's 48 foot long and 10 foot wide got a gate on each end we ain't got to try it out yet but we'll be here soon I think I might even put another gate here in the middle to kind of separate them once we get them in here. Might run me some more wire on the top just in case they try to jump out. Don't believe they will, but just in case. It took me about a month to get this all done, but I done it all pretty much myself, just me and Erica. I cut all the cedar posts myself, used a reclaimed lumber. 
I could end up with about about four hundred dollars in the whole thing if I'd bought the post and the two by sixes. It'd have been about twelve thirteen hundred dollars. So I got about one third of what's actually what it actually would have cost.